Did you have it out with Bronwyn publicly? Yes, I did. What happened? What what started that? She was probably the worst human being I have ever worked with ever in my whole entire life. Right? Like, she came out on Entertainment Tonight, said, well, no pleasantries, no well wishes. Her whole storyline was fake. Um, What was fake? Tell me specifically what was fake. um, I I think being the alcoholic. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, she bringing out like the lesbian she wanted to be the first person on bravo to be you know she just wanted so hard so much attention attention Mm -hmm. on her she told everybody that it was going to be her show and that she wants her own show and you know blah she was just a fake is she not an alcoholic you know what i don't believe anything she has to say okay Mm -hmm. there you go she is a liar she just has no credibility with you she is just a liar and allegedly Allegedly. she came on entertainment tonight and said that i was a racist just like Heather DeBro called me a racist too. Like, and look, I'm married to a Jew. Look, everybody uh, loves every, to get on everyone, that train everyone, with you. Every, yeah. Everyone loves to say the racist thing. Like, it's like it's, well, they say that's how liberals win arguments. Yes, by calling someone a racist. Right. Because how do you say you're not? How do you prove you're not a racist? Right. How you're a racist, Jeff. Jeff you're calls a me a racist all the time. Yeah. You're a racist. Well, you against Koreans. You're a racist. <laughs> 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 okay. It's going to be a hard argument then yeah. to win. So, you know, she, she said I was a racist. I was homophobic. She couldn't say anything nice about us getting married. No. Right. She was just like, eh, she's been married before. I, I don't just, know why would, like, she was just a, te- she's a, I don't know, you know, what's truth and what's fiction. I just, you know, my only concern is for the kids. You know, and this whatever she's going through with the, you know, living under the same roof and not you know, like married, but dating kids. other people. And, you know, that was the only thing because most of us put our, our children, children first. first. Of well, the thing of it is, is like, you know, she is actually hurting her kids. Like she's having an affair with this Fernanda chick. She broke up a marriage and she's like, you know, doing all this stuff. I mean, what kind of example are you setting for your children? Me, I get freaking ostracized and fired because... What I say, God's way of thinning the herd, which I didn't even write anyway, by the way, that I mean, every article that you read about me, they always put that in there. Mm -hmm. God's way of thinning the herd. I didn't write that. I'm not smart enough. Darwin (laughs) did. Okay. I I was reading an article and I said it because I read it. It's natural selection. I didn't wasn't hurting anybody. I didn't kill anybody. Was it insensitive? Yeah, probably. But I was just reading an article about it. And I'm like, that makes sense. 